no one can tell you have a wig on nobody can tell you have a wig on hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna be reviewing this beautiful wig that you guys are seeing and no this is not a list from wig so this unit is from unites hair thank you unites for sending this wig out please before you get into this video make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so yet and make sure you stay tuned and keep on watching Okay guys, now we're going to unbox this wig. As always, a wig comes with a couple of things, which is my favorite part. This one came with a wig cap, some really cute lashes that I'm going to be wearing throughout the video. And you guys also give me this really cute headscarf that I've never gotten before in a wig, so this is cool. So this wig is 22 inches long, it's 150% density and as you guys can see it is a curly V part human hair wig. I got it wet just a little bit to show you guys what it looks like when it's got water in it. So as you guys can see this wig has 5 clips that you can use to clip on your hair and it's also got 2 clips on the side and 1 at the back to secure your hair and it's also got some adjustable straps so that this way can fit well around your head I really like the way the front of this wig looks they made it very flat so that when you wear it it doesn't go bulky and it looks natural all right guys so here is the wig as you guys can see it's not fully dried just yet it needs to dry just a little bit more i simply just added water to this i know a lot of people say you should co-wash it co-washing is basically just adding conditioner to this hair and washing it and it helps to find the curls even more so if you have time you can go ahead and do that but i'm not gonna do that today because i didn't want the wig to be completely wet just yet the way i prepped my hair was so simple but super effective so as you guys can see i left the front part of my hair out so that it adds like a natural look so you guys will see exactly what i mean whenever i do this but it's important to leave some part of your hair out and that's the thing about this V part wig you want to leave some of your hair out so it looks natural so I did six braids up here everything else is going back the reason for that is I can do a middle part if I wanted to I can do a side part if I wanted to and I can do another side part so these braids makes it easy to sort of switch your wig around if you really wanted to and with a V part wig it has clips okay and these clips can pull the hair sometimes so the best thing to do is to swap it around if you don't swap this around and you always wear it in the same spot you can end up having a bald spot and you don't want a bald spot so it's super important to swap your wig around from time to time so that you know your hair doesn't get used to it and doesn't start pulling your hair off so that's the reason why I did my brace like this and I would definitely recommend everyone to do their brace like this if you're gonna be wearing a V part with clips okay and you simply just clip on clip clip on clip that's it yeah, so there are about two methods to wear this wig to make it look natural and i'm gonna show you guys these two methods right now however i will have a video with loads of different methods on how to wear this wig so guys if you haven't yet subscribed please do hit that subscribe button and do hit the bell so whenever i drop a video you will be notified straight away so guys i'm gonna go ahead and do the first method that i've been seeing everywhere and this method doesn't involve a leave out so you don't have to leave your hair out which is amazing i'm super happy to hear that so hopefully this method works let's go ahead and try it oh yeah my wig cap don't forget the wig cap girls this is just to protect my hair so the clips don't you know grab on my natural hair because i really hate tension guys and wearing a wig cap does help a little bit but anyway guys let's try this on guys let's take a minute to appreciate this hair it's so beautiful the curls are popping mm. the curls are popping yes baby mm -hmm. i'm feeling it i'm 
feeling it. <laughs> it's not even on properly yet and I'm loving it so far. Okay guys, so let's just get into this. Okay, first way I've seen people wear it. Basically, you just clip this on. I'm not gonna go too close to my edges. Because as you guys can see, it's not really pulling, but there is a bit of tension. So this is why it's so important to swap it around so you don't end up in a boat. Okay guys, so this is the way people wear it, but it's not yet over. What they do is they kind of grab a comb and they comb their hair out a little bit so it kind of lies on this thing. What do you call this? Would you call that a track? Yeah, well, so it lays on this track, but I'm not about to do that because it's definitely gonna end up breaking your hair, especially if you do it all the time. There is another way to do this sort of method without actually leaving your hair out, but you will need to undo one of your braids. All right guys, so my hair is out as you guys can see. Now let's try this method and see if it works. It looks like it's gonna work, but you never know unless you try. So let's go. Okay, so I'm not gonna clip it too close to the roots. I'm gonna go a bit back and kinda push my hair as I go. can see this method actually worked so much better and honestly it's not that bad it did cover some tracks you know if you're standing from far away no one can tell that this is not your real hair but if you come a bit close it's not too obvious guys it actually looks like you have a leave out even though you don't which is amazing yeah this method works so much better than leaving the cornrows out because guys you can end up breaking your hair so don't don't do that don't have your cornrows in and be trying to pull some hair out just to cover the tracks don't do that it's really gonna ruin your natural hair that you're actually trying to protect and like i told you guys earlier i did leave some hair out in front so it gives it that natural seamless look as you guys can see like, i can actually do my hair like this if i want it to mm, look at that no one can tell you have a wig on nobody can tell you have a wig on Okay guys, so now I'm really curious to see what it looks like with the leave out as well So I'm gonna go ahead and try it finally just to see what it looks like I took out this part of my hair like I told you guys earlier the beauty of these braids is that you can actually Be free with it. You can do whatever you want. You can go to the side to the middle to the left to the right You know be free with it and this time just to show you guys i just took one braid out as you guys can see and i'm just gonna go ahead and clip the v part on these two cornrows right here oh you guys i forgot my wig cap it feels so weird <sighs> honestly i hate that feeling like it just grabs on your hair oh if you know what i'm talking about please comment below because <laughs> It is really annoying.
finally finished the leave out method and I have a couple of thoughts on this first of all if you don't want to leave your hair out then this is not for you simple as that second of all you will have to have your curls defined you can maybe use eco standard gel to define your curls or you can use anti curling cream whatever you call it or maybe whatever you prefer to just bring out those curls so it really blends in with this hair so these are my thoughts for the leave out method apart from that i really like it i think it's simple if my hair was obviously like a different texture it will work more even though this is not my texture my natural hair type it still looks okay i can work with it but i think i really do prefer the other method the no leave out method because it just looks more natural and you don't need to do too much and another thing is you won't have to worry about fixing your hair throughout the day oh is my hair sticking up oh is this happening oh is that happening no you don't have to worry about any of those stuff you know what i'm saying overall the hair is beautiful as you guys can see the curl pattern is amazing i really like it the hair is super thick you guys it is thick. <laughs> it's super thick and yeah it really feels like you have something on your hair like there's volume there 100 percent i like big hair the bigger the better so i'm very happy with the volume and if you also want to play with it you can trim it you can add layers but i'm not gonna do too much to it because as you guys can see i like to play about with the wig so it kind of does look like i have some layers if you think about it i mean look at that look at that once again thank you so much to you nice hair for sending this unit you can use this special code right here on the screen to get yourself some money off the link to the wig and all the details of this wig will be in the description box down below so make sure you go ahead and check that one out if you're interested in buying this hair which you should be because i don't know why you wouldn't want to buy this it's beautiful i hope this video was really helpful to you guys if you're thinking of buying this wig and maybe you don't know how to style it if this video was helpful please leave a comment down below and also don't forget to give it a thumbs up to let me know that you guys enjoyed it and if you're new to this channel and you haven't yet subscribed please hit that subscribe button for me it means so much and it's completely free guys i will also have a video to show you guys various ways you can style this wig and wear this wig so please if you haven't yet subscribed they should give you more reasons to subscribe and stay tuned and also don't forget to hit the bell so every time i upload a new video you'll be notified if you guys have any suggestions the comment box is there for you so make sure you put it down there let me know what you want to see on this channel what content you would like or maybe what hairstyle you want to see next put it down there guys follow me on my instagram you can reach out to me there let's be friends you know let's keep up with each other let's see what's up thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye